as he looks in the distance with stoic eyes, scanning the perimeter to see what he could see. Happiness becomes him. Because this took way too long and it's done. At least this portion of it. This is John Bain. I want to welcome you to Ark Survival Evolve. Looking forward to having fun with you guys today like we do every day. Hope that you find something that you like. If you find something that you like, don't forget to slam the like button. It does help me out a lot. I really do appreciate it. And if you guys are new here, don't forget to subscribe. Always got something new coming out for you. Love for you to be here when it happens. Yeah. All right. So we are back on the Pooping Evolve Pug Nation server. I did not do that. Ridpolf was like trying to make a statement there. I guess he's like he's he he's 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 he, he's protesting Halloween. See, look at that. I told you he's protesting Halloween. Don't you yell at me. Uh uh. Nah. No. We just started building and you had to poop all over. Thank you very much. Uh, yeah, we're back on the Pug Nation Island, pooping vault server provided by Logic Servers, by the way. And um, meow. We have started working on the corridors. And now you don't want Halloween to be a thing. You want Christmas. You know, you already can go to department stores and there's probably Christmas everywhere already, okay? So we can have our little bit of Halloween, all right? Thank you. Anyway, um, so we are going to build some corridors going this way towards the back end of the structure. And back in the back end of the structure, I think we have enough space back here to do some uh, massive, like, chamber pot. Uh, I don't know. Something. Uh, maybe to put our better boss dinos in or something like that. And uh, at the sections here in the middle, we have the lovely elevators here. And they are going up over to there. And bam, we got these going up and down. And these will go all the way down to the basement section too. Let's go ahead and land. Land. Here we go. And go down. And then we go down and we're in the elevator near where the... Stables are at. So we have one on either side too. So this this way we have a nice complete area to get places and get all the way up to the top. And there we go. So uh, what I've been doing is getting our, uh, some more railings made and a lot more mats done together. But I wanted to say hello. And well, oh, we got enough railing to do something. Let's go ahead and build something right quick. Well, right quick as in like for the rest of the day, maybe. Um, Let's see. Let's do this. Go over. Down over here. And I'm gonna do this. So I've already placed the ceilings up. You got glass ceiling tech in the glass. There is 11 floors plus one leading to the elevator. And there's 11 floors plus one leading this way. And to make these edges happen, I think I already talked about it in the last episode, is I had to put two walls down and then stack railings up below it. And then that's, that's, that's how we do that section of it. So let me go ahead and pull these out. And I'll do, well, no, the printer. Don't you yell at me. There's that. Okay, there's that. And we'll continue to pull this out in this row. We'll just go ahead and do the row. We'll do, come on. There you go. Okay. A little bit of lag. Don't know why. It's not like this is a massive build yet. And we have to do it like this, and then we'll pull out the bottom row of railings. And then I've also got to change the railings into half walls. I really wish the model gun would let us do that. It would make it a lot more uh, quality of life, user-friendly type thing. But this is making sure that these half walls line up correctly on the edges of our ceilings. Marrow. Let's pull these out. Just do a little examplizations here. There we go. There we go. And they're going to jump off. Press O, oh, zero, whatever. There we go. And then go and line these up and just switch them over. Half wall. Half wall. Half wall. Half wall. Half wall. It's out. Half wall. And then underneath it, since we have that, we don't need this wall anymore. It's only there for that purpose and that purpose only. And then we can continue to snap these in line with everything else. And go all the way across. So, what I've got to do is not only this entire one, but this entire one as well, which is already prepped and ready to go on this side, except for I didn't completely prep and ready to go all the way on this side. So we'll have to do all that and I'll get that done. And then we'll come back and see where we're at and then maybe get started on the main structure in the back or the towers. We'll decide on what to do. But you guys, you know the deal. Welcome back! And I'm here with my big bubble blower. The blower of bubbles that doesn't actually blow bubbles. 
I'm just saying. All right, we're back, and we are in the middle of more builder relations. Figure to stop by, check in with you guys, and just see what's happening. Uh, we have most of the corridors, uh, basic lines up. I had to put in half walls so I could snap the walls above it correctly to get the, the correct posturalizations of the, the lineage we are looking for here. Um, going across, you can see we have a beautiful line, and the whole reason for doing this is so these half walls don't stick through the floors. Uh, there's nothing more than I hate when you're running across your build, and then all of a sudden you hear because your feet are like tripping on the little pieces sticking through. So as you can see here, we'll go up over in this end. And go over here, and you can see down... Whoa, 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 dumb dirt. Right back over, please. Right back at you. Thank you. You see here, we don't have that sound. That's what we're going for. Nice, clean lines is what the whole deal is about. That's what the whole deal is about. So this is what this is how I'm accomplishing that. There's probably other ways to do this. This is the way I've chosen, which, of course, you know, in ARC, it's not usually the best way. It is the arterist, and it, but it works. So that's what we're doing. At least we're closing in on this. Is This is actually has been a lot more of a time investment. I knew when I decided not to do a flat ceiling that this would become uh, a little bit more, again, to use the word, arterist. Ardorus. You know what I'm saying. Anyway, um, that is not the way. This is the way. So it's, it's looking good. I'm, I'm happy with it. I can't wait to see it done. Um, I'm completing the part that has a tower yet since I don't know exactly how I'm going to build a tower. So I want to at least have like this consistently done. I can uh, edit it later after we get through it. But uh, since I'm already going through all this, I might as well just go ahead and get it done. 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 I got this here. This here, and let's get that across, and then we have to go across here and pull this across like this. And this here, 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 this here. And we have to do that again across the bottom row. Right here, like that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, I'm hitting the wall behind me. That's the problem. There's a problem. Houston, we have a problem. And that will give us our nice finished line underneath it to match it up. And the reason why I'm doing an interior, you might not be able to see it here, but when we're walking down the corridors, I want to be able to see like that. And it gives it more of a nice support look to it and kind of like a tech. I love the tech mixed with the glass and the metal. I think that looks really nice. It breaks it up some. And then we use this kind of transparency to really give it that nice finished look, I, in my opinion, anyway. I'm just saying, you know what I'm saying? And again, the light changes here, as you can see, but it's still got the same... No, it doesn't. Who who messed with my build? You did. You pulled those up earlier. That's not my fault. Oh, they are right. It's part of that crazy light thing that's happening here. Uh, we have an issue with this set. As you can see, there is a half circle. If you look on the ground, you can see this huge circle of shadow. I think it, what it is is a simplified version of the mountain uh, shadow coming down. And what it does, it messes with the builds with uh, the glass set on how it reflects. So you can see where where the lip of it is actually getting reflected on the glass differently. So that's why you see a difference. There's not anything I can do about it. It's a large enough build to where it shouldn't really, really mess with things too much. It probably will, and I'll hate it every time I look at it. But that's besides the point, because we can go on this side and look at it, and it's beautiful. It's beautiful. You are beautiful, no matter what I think. Okay, anyway. Ah, uh, I didn't say that. Anyway, um, I think what I'll do is, I haven't done this in a while, we'll do some speedy yuppie stuff for you guys, and we'll get some more builderizations done, and uh, get to get some fast forward in for it, and then we'll come back uh, after a bit. See, here we go.
Welcome back. We have finished. Hopefully you enjoy the fast forwarding of what we had all over the conversations of where we did the building and stuff like that. And I don't know really we're done. Ooh. I'll lay off the caffeine. All right, so we're back and we got stuff done. Uh, as you saw with the builderizations that occurred, we got everything done. The lower portions of, of these walkways are finished. That is the, the most time consuming portion of it all that is happening. Uh, we now have to place our walls up tastefully, which uh, need to be snapped like that. Of course, it's not going to do this. It's going to do the arc thing. So, um, yeah. Oh, great. This is great. Great. How <laughs> about like that? There we go. So this is the, once we get these bottom walls snapped when they're supposed to be snapped correctly in the manner in which we asked it to, because it's being arc. This is, this is the fun part of, okay. Sometimes it, now that way it's going to still, oh, it snapped. Okay. See, there we go. We, the randomness of things are is totally random here. Look at that. Nope. Someone low. Okay. But if we, well, wrong button. Uh, let's try that again. Shall we? I'm not moving anything. I'm not pressing Q. Da, na, 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 na. Nope. All right, let's try this way. Uh, ready to lighten up for a little bit for you guys. Still no. Okay, let's try like this again. Okay, let's go on the outside side and see if it works better like this. It doesn't. Okay, nice, nice. I hate how what it is. I think these the uh, game is actually lying. It's not the mod. It's or anything like that. Is that it, it? It's it's there's like a bug in it or something that says this is actually like this, but it's not. And it can't decide. I wish I wish I could choose a piece or a plane for it to snap to. Like choose this entire plane of ceilings uh, with uh, with a tool or something, and then that's the only place that the the future pieces will snap to. That would be an amazing tool. But uh, it doesn't exist, so it is what it is. So we're with what we're given. And this is what makes builds take five years. Other than having to grind for all the mats. Is that going to snap up? It did not. I was hoping it would, but it did not. Now... It still didn't. <laughs> ah! Ugh! That's what that roof over there that I was talking about up there? Yeah, that, that took like one piece, took two hours to do. Actually, it was that roof on the central piece. Uh, yeah, it was because of this kind of thing, except I could never get the point to work. Even though it would say it would go there, it would never go there. Look at that. It still went down. Let's try it this way again. You can see the joys of this game. Okay, maybe this is the correct angle that it wants. <sighs> All right, this looks like it's working. But this is going to be my world for the next, oh, who knows how long it takes to snap this. But once we have these bottom one, these ones snapped, everything else will do. I don't have to worry about snap points anymore for the corridors. So that that's a good thing. That's a good thing. But it's going to take us a minute to get these pieces in. And hopefully they snap up like they're supposed to. And then we'll have happiness in a in to-go container. And then. So I guess I guess I need to go ahead and run all these over. And uh, we will return, so, um, yeah, all that fun stuff. We are now placing ceilings on our new corridors of love. 49 times I've placed these ceilings. I'm kidding. Um, we are going to... This is this is the icing on the cake, actually. Compared to all the other snapping and things we had to do, this is way easier and faster than, than the previous you know, workload we had. Like, see how much faster this is going? I'm going to break something now. And someone's going to really screw up. I got to take it all apart and redo it again. I know when I say this one arc, but we're going to try anyway. Um, yeah, like that whole side is done. And we, we still got to go through and change the windows and the tint. But I mean, this is so much. I'm glad we did the hard part first because the the, the, the longer hard part ish. I don't know if that's really considered hard. It's just more time consuming, I guess. It's hard to kind of figure it out at first, but then once you got to figure it out, it's just kind of... I'm good. That's that was that was John Bainese for uh oh gosh darn it. All right, let's go over here. All right, here, put these across. And I'm really happy with how these look. It's gonna look really good once we build the huge building in the back. I mean, you thought that building was huge up here. Wait until we build the one in the back. 
let's see. Let's go over here and sign about that and try it again. Right here. Come across. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah. Ooh, that was, that was oh yeah, I forgot this side was already pretty much done. And well, more done than the other side, so that made this a little bit easier. Loving. This is, and you know what I'm gonna end up doing? We ought to try it, is get some of the, um, let's do that now. That's, we need some happy fun times. I'm down with some happy fun times. Let's get some of the other S plus things that we can do and, and see if we can make a way to get through this a little bit faster if we want. Where is it at? Uh, is it an attack? Uh, let's see. That's just a ceiling. Let's say auto. Oh, what? Autocraft. Any recipe you selected from inside? Oh, nice, nice. Here it is. Repulsor plate. Let's make eight of these. Here we go. All right, so we got that there. Now I'm going to do something I probably regret. I'm going to pick up this piece and put this one in there. And then we're just strength to plus a million. All right. And then we're going to adjust the pitch. Like that. So, and now we can hide the arrow. Yeah! Holy crap! It's kind of like a rail gun for people. I'm just saying. It's kind of like a rail gun for people. Let's get rid of on this one. Let's try that again. Let's get around here. Let's get Rip Paul. Rip Paul. We're going to have some fun. You ready? Okay. Okay. You ready, buddy? Go. Yeah. <laughs> 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 All right. We'll do it one more time. Then we'll be serious. Wow. I know. I know. Okay, uh, I think for some reason, I feel like if we just tone down the strength just a tad bit, I'd rather have too much power than not enough. You know what I mean? So let's bring just the strength. Let's bring it down to like seven. Let's see what that does. Okay, that's not too bad. Let's try eight. Uh, just strength. Let's try eight. We keep hitting our heads on the top there. Let's try it again. All right, let's try nine. Seems like 10 is like, you know, like more than 10. Yeah, it keeps doing it in that now. Hmm. Did I accidentally change the arrow or does something just weird or? Huh. We'll go back to 10 again. Okay, that was better. What was the difference? What happened? All right, let's try this. Let's go over. Ah, right, that's good. That's good. I'm down with that. That's that works for me. So, well, that's right there. So we'll go to this side and pull this one up. Place it here. And I wish I could take the settings and 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 do the same thing. So we need to have it at. Oops, wrong button. Just strength. We need it at 10. And then we need to change the pitch. Oh, we could do that? Oh, that was sucked. It was that was pretty cool, but that sucked. Let's try this. Okay. Adjust pitch. Can I reset it? No. Uh let's make it go to. Let's try 85. Was that what it was on? What is this one on? Let's match it up. Pitch. 75. Negative 75. So let's do negative 75 on this one. Uh, Pitch. 75. Negative 75. 
There we go. We got that one. Now we're going to change out this one. Now we'll go to pitch. We'll do... We need to do plus on this one, I think. No, this one snapped weird. Okay, so... So we need to do roll. Negative 75. And then do the strength. That's pretty nice. <laughs> Dad, what are you doing? I don't know. Whoa! Whoa! What the? What the hell? I don't know what that was about, but okay. All right, so let's grab this right here. Pull this out. Let's pop in this guy right here. I think this one's probably going to need the same thing with the roll. So let's see what that does. There we go. That, yeah, that's right. Okay, now we'll go to strength. Plus 10. Nice. Perfect. Awesome. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Bow. Okay, so that's all in line. Let's go ahead and I'm going to get these walls looking pretty good. And there we go. Let's go here. Let's grab this. Whoa! Close up. Close up on the good stuff. Uh, let's get this here, this here, and that. Ooh. And we'll take you and we'll take this guy and go right here. So we're going to skip that one because that's our central piece with, the, with that. So pop that there. Two, three, four. And then do this one too. And this way we can hit up all the areas, like all the areas. Like if there's any areas left, I don't know which area that would be because we're hitting up all the areas. And pick up this one. Let's get that one. We got this guy here. Very nice. Very, very nice. Okay. And then this one here. Ah! Da, da, da. There we go. This way it all looks more cohesive. -er. There we go. And now we need to grab you. This one up. And this way it all looks very nice and peachy. And I think what I can do is just knock this out too. Then we'll come back. A what's, what's, what's happening? Yeah. Okay. That worked there. But wow. That was weird. Okay. Okay. That was weird. I'm just saying that was weird. There we go. But what we'll just do is go ahead and finish this part out and then come back and then we'll look and see what the fabulousness it provides for us for our viewing entertainment. You guys, hold on. As he looks in the distance with stoic eyes scanning the perimeter to see what he could see. Happiness becomes him. Because this took way too long and it's done. At least this portion of it. Uh, this has been a long experience of time. I end up having to pull up the slopes and the ceilings because there was little gaps because I forgot that these will sometimes snap to the ceilings or snap to the other one, which will, in will not snap the same together. So I pulled up everything and did the slopes first and then came back with the ceilings. So, you know, uh, th th this took a little bit. And while that was happening, I got an idea. You know, it's kind of like when you're playing the song in the middle of playing the song, you came up with an idea for another song. Um, let's use a repulsor of love. Bam, son. I like those. Oh, repulsor is right there. Let's grab you. I have ideas to try out for our towers to support the central section of this. Now I'm thinking that I shouldn't have done that at that repulsor. Now I'm thinking that we could take th this square here and this square. We we gotta we gotta teach a bit teach to we gotta teach him something. Don't bite on my base! Kids these days. It's a level 44. Kids these days, they get no 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 respect. No respect at all. But I'm thinking like right here, here, and here, maybe run a support system up and kind of go from that and get some ideas on some shapes. Uh first of all, we're gonna go ahead and template out a section and then go from there. Uh, let's do that right now. I can't move at all because I've got too, I got way too many of those. That should be enough. There we go. 
Okay, so we only probably need like a couple. Um, we're gonna keep with our. Ooh, that's that wall did not snap correctly. What is that wall too? Oh crap. Um, let's pick that up and replace it. I can't have that. That's not allowed. You are not allowed to be like that, sir. Better. That's much better. That was, that was, this is, this one's not going to snap, right? That's what the problem's going to be. Okay, we're okay. All right, so let's go here and do this one as well from the outside. And just kind of see how this looks. This is forming an idea together. Okay, so we have that, and I'm thinking about up here. Let's grab some of these. I'm going to just template out. This is all this is, is just templating. Uh, so to get kind of form the idea and then let it influence future ideas. That's kind of how I do my stuff. So kind of get ideas looking at it, get stuff to get more ideas. And uh, that's how you get more ideas when you get the ideas and kind of go with the ideas more. Let's go with, you won't snap at the lower side. Okay, so we need some walls. Which I don't have. Let's put that back in there. Put that back in there. Let's grab some metal walls. I guess I need to grab some railings too, just so I can maybe work with these things a little bit better. Let's get back up here. All right. So up here, we're going to grab that. And we want to snap to the bottom section like that. Let's put another one below you. And that way I can pull this one off and put a railing here. All right, and then we can come out with this. This is the same height as the other section of it and maybe bring this this little part out on both sides and then bring the glass out and build a little bubble. Maybe raise the ceiling up by one or a half height and then make that all glass. And then have these slope in or something like that. Hmm. Let's see here. Uh, let's go around to this side and pull that. Let's do this here too. So we have a visual representation of what we're trying to accomplish. It went high. It didn't go right. Go low. <laughs> no. You're fired. I think that did it. Yeah, it looks like it did. Yeah. Again, we're just templating. This is, this is all probably going to come up and, and then pull off some of the walls and stuff just to make sure it all snaps correctly. Like that. Okay. So the overall shape, trying to visualize how it's going to work out together here. I'm okay with it. Now, whoa. Now with the central section here, I'm thinking about we maybe we can come up with something a little bit a little more clever and maybe have like another set of these going here. Like that. And then having little arches across the center. So I'm not really sure if that's what we should do. Coming across there. I don't know. Um also I was thinking too, we could probably do some little star patterns off of here. Not that. Like a star pattern. Uh, what'd you snap to? It's not correct. You are not correct, but think about like a little star pattern or maybe star patterns off of this. And going up to it. I'm not really sure just yet. I guess I need to fiddle around with it some more. Come up with some ideas. So what I'm going to do is, uh, well, fiddle around with it some more. Come up with some ideas. And we will be right back. So, you guys, hold on. Welcome back. We've got something figured out. This took a little while. Longer than I assumed it would take. Um, so what we did is use our quarter ceilings to do offsets from the center square. And, um, actually just grab like, uh, and then use some ceilings to like snap it over so we can do half depth areas. Like if you look up here, you can see the, the height of these walls or the width of these walls. The spacing is over is just a half, half width of the ceiling. If I could talk today, I'd be all right. 
you can see here, you can see then I use those to do it and then use the glass ceilings to lock in these dynamic pillars that tied it in together. I think it looks all right. I think it's a good start. I don't think it's the final phase of what we're going to do, but I think it's a good start. Like I said, why does that look brown? That looks ugly. Why are you brown? you like rainbow brown. That's like when you eat too much oil and you poop. Um, anyway, so it's coming together. I th think what we got to do, though, is do more work on this to get it together. But we are short on time. It took a long time today just to get these tubulars done together. I'm pretty happy with that. And I'm liking the start of these supports. Uh, we will have to match up both sides. But I think it's a good start. I was trying to do some crisscross stuff here. What sucks is that the, the vanilla ramp is a different angle than the S plus ramp. The S plus ramp actually is right, in my opinion. This vanilla one, uh, uh, I really wish that uh, we could get some happy. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Did this do what I thought? Is that a different spacing? It's, uh, yeah, we're not, we're just not, no, no, no. No, no, we'll figure something out. I think the top needs to get built, but that is the time we have today. Hopefully you guys are liking what you see. This is coming together. This has been a long, t long build so far. Everything is pretty nice and less fandangoed. I'm looking forward to finishing up this. We'll probably work on that next time. Then we'll go fight some bosses or something. We need to mix things up a little bit too. Can't be just building all the time. Got to do some things all the time because Ark has more than just building to offer. Didn't know that until recently, but I'm just saying. <laughs> anyway, guys, as always, Thank you so very much, and you have yourselves a good night.